Hello everyone, this is Robert Sack from Android Pit and today I'll be showing you how to get that Android M app drawer on other Lollipop devices. So the Android M app drawer, which I don't yet have installed on this device, the HTC One M9, basically it lists the apps in the app drawer alphabetically and also it arranges them by having your most frequently used ones at the very top. So it monitors how often you use certain apps and then it will show your favourites at the top of the app drawer rather than just have them mingled among all the other apps which is pretty handy for, for many people. Uh, so you don't need to wait for Android M to get this update, you can actually get it already on Android Lollipop. To do this, first you need to get the Google Now Launcher on your device. So you go to the Play Store and you search for Google Now Launcher which I've already done here. When it gets to the Google Now Launcher screen, if it says open or uninstall then that means you've already got Google Now Launcher and you don't need to install it again. If it says install then you want to install the Google Now Launcher and then when you've got it you want to tap open and then it's going to ask you do you want to use Sense Home well if you have an HTC it will ask you if you want to use Sense Home uh, if you have another phone it will ask you if you want to use that phone's default interface as your home or use Google Now Launcher. So you'll want to tap Google Now Launcher on this screen and as you can see everything suddenly become very lollipoppy. It's all bubbly and kind looks kind of like the, the stock lollipop interface all of a sudden. Um, so going into the app drawer, this is the lollipop app drawer that you'll get if you have stock lollipop. As you can see it's horizontal scrolling, it's not really organized in any particular way, there's no favorites list or anything. So the next step you want to do to to get the favorites list, etc. I'll just say, yep, always use Google Now Launcher as home. So the next thing you want to do to, to get the Android M app drawer and have it organized like you would on Android M is get the Google APK for Android M, the Google App APK. To do this, we've provided a link for you at the top left corner of this video. Just click that link, let it download to your device, and when it does so, the next thing you'll want to do is find the APK on your device and open it. But before doing that, you'll need to make sure that you've got, uh, you're allowing unknown sources on your device. So you'll want to go to settings, scroll down to security, and then make sure that the unknown sources box is ticked. So we've already got it ticked here. I might as well untick it, tick it again, and then it's going to ask you just a security question saying that you're more at risk of attack, which uh, which we're, we can confidently say that you probably won't be attacked by, uh, by allowing unknown sources if you're careful. You just tap OK. And then you install the Google App APK, which is at the top corner of this video. And once you've done that, you you go to either File Manager or or the Downloads folder on your device basically go to the place where the APK will automatically install which in my case is the download folder on my device as you can see at the top here I've got the com.google.android APK here I think the one you download might say velvet google APK that's fine as well just tap it tap install when google asks you if you want to accept its permissions and then just patiently wait for it to install. In a second it's going to ask me a couple more things, just say yes to that. It's taking a little while to install actually, it took a bit longer than on the Moto G, which is a, which is a bit of a strange thing considering how powerful this phone is. So it says uh, app installed now, and the next thing you do is just simply tap open. It's going to take a second to, to load. And then when you tap the app drawer, you can see that it's different. It's now vertically scrolling, unlike the stock lollipop one we had a second ago. Um, it's going to display your favorite apps at the top. So I haven't started using it yet, so they're not displayed yet. But as you do, all your favorite ones will be kind of listed at the top here. You can tap search uh, at the top right and then just search for your apps. And yeah, this is uh, the Android M app drawer experience. So you may li like it, you may not. We think it's pretty handy. We think it adds a, an extra dimension to, to keeping your apps organized. And hopefully you will too. If you don't want to get it now, of course, you can always wait for the Android M update when it rolls out. But that will be uh, a few months yet. 
So subscribe to the AndroidPit.com YouTube channel and for more Android news, tips and reviews visit AndroidPit.com.